In a multi-phase study, we investigate the trade-offs and benefits of replacing standard mouse buttons with pressure sensors and introduce the pressure tap and hard press double click techniques for this new type of button, the P button. In today's computing world, the mouse is a critical link between the user and the graphical user interface. Of particular importance are the mouse buttons and the user's ability to click and double click. But since mouse buttons are only capable of two states, up and down. Average users are very limited in the ways they can use a mouse to interact with a computer. Adding secondary devices to the mouse can increase functionality, but doing so can also decrease usability due to the physical size limitations of the mouse. A better solution may be to replace the mouse buttons with devices that can operate as a button and also offer richer, more dynamic interaction, such as pressure sensors. Research has shown a wide range of rich interactions possible with pressure sensors, but can pressure sensors do the work of a mouse button? To answer this question, we first develop four different implementations of a pressure sensor button, or P button. Pressure click mode is designed to be as similar to a mouse button as possible. Applying a certain amount of pressure generates a mouse down, while releasing a certain amount of pressure generates a mouse up. However, pressure click is missing the tactile feedback and audible click of a real button. So we create pressure click audio mode, which plays clicking sounds on mouse down and mouse up. In pressure tap mode, a click is registered if the user applies and releases pressure within a time interval of 150 milliseconds. Anything slower is not registered as a click. Pressure tap is also missing tactile and oral feedback, so we create pressure tap audio mode, which plays a mouse down sound when pressure is applied and a mouse up sound if a click is successfully registered. In our first study, we tested users' ability to single click, comparing the left and right mouse buttons with the four P button modes in the left and right mouse button locations. To test a sensor in place of the mouse button, we first disable the mouse button by taping it down, and then attach the sensor to the top of the button location we are testing. The experimental setup required the subjects to single click when a timer reached zero. Our results show that there is no significant difference between modes, with button click and pressure tap being fastest overall. For our second study, we tested users' ability to double click in the left mouse button location only. Carrying over the three most successful modes from our first study, we developed two additional modes to assist with double clicking. Hard press mode streamlines the double click process by taking advantage of the wide range of pressure values the sensor can detect. To double click in hard press mode, the user pushes down hard once and a double click is activated. The hard press pressure level is calibrated for each user. We also create a hard press audio mode that plays clicking sounds to indicate a successful double click. Our results show that hard press performs very well, beating out the standard mouse button double click in speed. A P button mouse could do the work of today's mouse and facilitate richer interactions, allowing users to fluidly control line thickness in drawing applications, bi-directional zooming with maps, and the gas and brake pedals of a car in a computer game.